Hello everybody, 2050 7 here, and welcome to episode 7 of Animal Crossing New Horizons. Uh, where last episode, we did a whole heck of a lot of stuff. We uh, introduced this new guy, we made a vaulting pole, we went exploring on the other side of the river, and um, yeah, it was a fun day. Uh, so now we're back again for another episode. Also, okay, I'm, I know that these guys were talking about building more buildings, so I want to see if that's the next thing I need to do. Because I feel like it is, because... I actually have run out of stuff to do now. Um, so let's talk to this guy first. Quest 7 Congratulations on your new home. A home is sure to open up so many new possibilities for you. You'll be wanting stylish furniture for that new home, which you could always scroll as craft as DIY projects, but I recommend you check in the offerings from Nook Shopping. Okay. It does take a bit of time to get your order delivered, but they have a daily rotating selection of goods. That includes fashionable things that can be hard to get on an island. <laughs> you can check out Nook Shopping and the Nook Stop and Resident Services, okay? And I'm assuming you have relatively the same thing to say. Hello there, Corbett C7. Congratulations on your new home. I have something I would like to chat about. If you have a moment, that is. This is a bit of a proposal, so now it's not a good time. No understanding. <laughs> I understand completely, no pressure. Um, okay. I don't know if proposal is the word choice that I would use, but <laughs> keep going. <laughs> Uh, sure. Very good. I'll get right to the point. I'm hoping that you might be interested in collaborating on a new venture. Building a new shop. Yes. After all, our little island community is growing, and our needs are growing too. I'd love to offer a much wider inventory of goods, but as you can see, I'm a bit limited here. I've already spoken with our fearless leader, of course, and he agrees that we have a need. Ah, but here's the thing. Building materials here are hard to get, so can we set them aside for building a shop? I really don't see it since we all need those materials for residential projects, but I have an idea. Yes, yes, you can gather up materials from around the island, right? From trees and rocks? Our environmental review even suggests there will be a zero impact to the native flora or fauna. Ah, but I'm getting off track. We'll need a lot of materials for a proper shop, and we will of course offer compensation for your efforts. Uh, maybe something that could help me pay off my ginormous house loan? <laughs> Please? Thank you so much. Now, I know this is a lot, but I put together I put together a list of items I'd like you to gather. We'll need 30 pieces, 30 pieces each of regular wood, hardwood, and softwood, and 30 iron nuggets. Wow, this guy does not mess around. I'm not concerned where these about where these materials come from. They could come from this island or any other. Uh, and you can gather these materials at your own pace. Once you have a set of something, come see me. Okay, so he just gave me a giant task, which I'm going to try and complete this episode. So, uh, we need 30 of each type of wood. Oh yeah, I have these fossils. Okay, I should go give these to Blathers to clear out my inventory and to uh, progress that along a little bit further because I would like there to be a museum. So, hey Blathers, uh, I have some fossils for you if you wouldn't mind. Please let me know if you have any items to donate or need assistance. I'm here to help. Okay, uh, make a donation. Marvelous! What would you like to donate? Uh, okay, so I can don- oh, fossil. Yes. Ho! Oh! Indeed, there can be no doubt. This is a fossil! Incredible! Wonderful! Remarkable! My intuition was impeccable. There are fossils on this island. But I digress. Back to the matter at wing. I must assess your fabulous find. <laughs> matter at wing. <laughs> Let me see here. Hmm. Indeed. Hoo-hoo. This is most assuredly an ophthalmo... ophthalmo torso. Ophthalmo torso. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. My feathers, what a fabulous fossil. Uh, this... I'm not going to try and say that again. This torso would be a sizable step toward opening the museum. I wonder, would you perhaps consider donating this ancient relic to the cause? Uh, I'm donating it. I do not want to pronounce its name. How wonderful. I'll add this to our collection with the utmost haste. I never thought I'd lay eyes on such a well-preserved ophthalmo torso. Dare me, I might give you a short presentation on the topic. I'm quite knowledgeable, you know. Uh, okay. Wonderful. Just fascinating stuff, I assure you. 
Now, where to begin? The adorable, the adorable ophthalm, opth, ophthalmosaurus. <laughs> Cutest of all the all the lichtisaurs. Oh my gosh, the itch 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 disaurs. <laughs> Why do I feel like Nintendo put these in here so that YouTubers would get stumbled up on them? <laughs> what makes a large sea-dwelling reptile cute, you may ask? I shall tell you. The eyes. Oh my gosh! His face was a gong. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Ophthalmolosaurus's name was means eye lizard, and its face was quite dominated by those great orbs. Uh, besides their cutifying effect, these eyes give a creature great vision, making it a very successful hunter. And no doubt, because it's big, doe eyes lull prey into a false sense of security. <laughs> and, th and that is what I have to say about that. Any hoot, <laughs> I will gladly accept your generous donation. I only hope we can find what remains of this fossil and display it in its fully assembled form. Many thanks to you, and best of luck. Uh, yes, now then. This also applies to be the fossil you brought this time, but only a specialist such as myself can appraise a newly discovered fossil to determine its proper designation. From now on, do please bring me any fossil of unknown oranges you find. Whether or not you choose to donate it is up to you. Either way, I shall gladly assess it. With this, we need 14 donations to open the museum. Needless to say, I am eager to accept your continued contributions. Okay, well, I have one more, and I'm not gonna, I do not want a presentation this time. Uh, make a donation. Thank you very much. My feathers. Why? It seems you have nothing on your person we can accept this time. Wait, what? We are currently accepting bugs, fish, and properly assessed fossils. That is, fossils must first be appraised by yours truly. So, if you have a relic of unknown origin, please allow me to give it a look. Oh, okay, so I have to, like, show it to him first? This is not here to help. Okay, so, assess fossils. Okay. What do you like to assess? Uh, this one. Let me see here. Hmm. Indeed. Hoo-hoo. <laughs> After some consideration, I can safely declare this fossil to be a left tarot wing. A splendid specimen in superb condition. Indeed, we will be one step closer to opening our museum with a left tarot wing like this. Would you donate this relic of the past to, future, to further our museum's future? Uh, I'm donating it. Uh, I want to roll out this to our collection with the utmost haste. I never thought I'd lay eyes on such a well-preserved left tarot wing. Uh, Damien, I might give you a short presentation. Uh, no. I see. Very well. I shall gladly accept your generous donation. Now, I only hope we can find the remaining parts and display the completed fossil. Best of luck. Okay, you need 13. Needless to say, I'm eager to accept your continued contributions. Okay, so... I'm here to help. Okay, I have one more fossil to give you. It is this one over here. Now, it would be really cool if it was a right tarot wing, you know, just saying. <laughs> Let me see here. Hmm, indeed. Okay, uh, of course, it could be but one thing. A Tricera torso. <laughs> a splendid specimen in superb condition. Okay, I think I think he says the same thing every time. Okay, yeah, he does. Uh, yes, I would like to donate it. No, I don't want a presentation. Uh, I'm a bit busy. I see, very well. I shall gladly accept your generous donation. Now. With this, we need 12 donations to open the museum. Okay. <sighs> Uh, okay, um, I think I can give him a pill bug too. Ooh, a sand dollar. Uh, Venus comb. Why do I feel like this is stuff you would want? Uh, make a donation. Do I? Thank you very much. My feathers. Why is he? Okay, I don't have anything he wants. Bugs, fish, and fossils. Okay, so I need to. I, I know I have a bug um, back at my house. So let me go and grab that. And a loach. I'll give him the loach. <laughs> Although, I gave Tom Nook a loach, didn't I? So maybe, like, maybe he won't take it? We'll see. Let's see. So I'll grab... I don't think he wants a Nintendo Switch for the museum. <laughs> uh, pill bug, move to pockets, loach, move to pockets. And now let's go back to Blathers. <laughs> okay, so you know what really sucked? 
because I was tired of it being dark in my videos. So I came on here at like 3 o'clock one day to record episodes um, 4 and 5, I believe. And it was raining. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so... Also, knowing how to start a fire would be quite nice. Bladders, can you tell me that? <laughs> uh, please, let me know if you have items to donate. Okay, uh, make a donation. Marvelous, what would you like to donate? Uh, this here pill bug. Eek, a pill bug. <laughs> the horror, the repugnance. Good heavens, I must maintain my composure. <laughs> I like this guy. Hmm, I beg your pardon. Bugs, I do detest them. Still, there's much I can tell you about the insect you apprehended. If you insist, that is. Uh, no thanks. Yes, yes, understood. <laughs> I don't think he wanted to tell me about that. <laughs> Anywho, my sincerest thanks for your donation. And though bugs are the bane of my existence, rest assured the wretched thing will get the best of care here. Uh, okay, so I see a fish tank there, so if I give you a fish, will it go appear in that tank? Uh, make a donation. Uh, my feathers, you don't think I, oh, okay. So I, I think that since I already gave Tom Nook a loach, then I can't give Blathers a loach now. So I'm just gonna go throw this loach into the river <laughs> because I don't know what else I'm gonna do with it if I can't donate it and I can't cook it. So, loach, uh, no. As funny as that is, <laughs> no. Um, uh, release, yes. Go back where you came from, okay. So what, what was I gonna do now? Um, I'm gonna go talk to Oh yeah, I need to get 30 of each type of wood and 30 iron nuggets. Okay, so I'm going to take my axe around. Flimsy axe. I guess. Oh yeah, because I'm trying to break it so I can make a stone axe. Yeah, okay. Alright. Oh, the axe broke. Okay, so let me just pick up these items real quick. And then go make another axe. Unless I happen to have one on me, which uh, does not look like I do. But, okay. So I can go over there and get that stone that I dropped. And I have wood. I need a tree branch. I can make another flimsy axe. And I can use the flimsy axe in the crafting recipe and make the... The not-so-flimsy axe. Whatever that's called. I forget. So you're coming with me, bud. And you're coming with me, bud. We're going back to the house. <laughs> Ooh, that's good music. I like that. I could get used to having that in my house. Okay, um... Yeah, let's let's take the wood out of storage just, just so that I know how much I have. Oh, looks like I already had tree branches too, so... And stones, okay. I'm gonna take all this stuff that I need for crafting axes out of the storage area. Uh, okay, shovel. I can make a shovel. Okay, good to know. I can make a... a decent shovel. Uh, let's make, I want to make this axe. Okay, what does it take to make this one? Wood, a flimsy axe, wood, iron, iron. Okay, so I can make a flimsy axe. Need five tree branches? Are you joking? Okay, let's just grab this. I can make a flimsy axe. And instead of leaving it flimsy and using it while it's flimsy and having it break, I can make it into a better axe. It won't break as quickly, theoretically. Hopefully. Uh, yes, let's craft stuff. Uh, so, okay, never mind. For a second there, I thought that was the, uh, Windfall Island music from Legends of Zelda The Wind Waker, but, nope. Uh, keep crafting. Uh, because now I have a flimsy axe and I can make a really good axe. Yes. I made an axe. Yes, keep crafting. I want to make a shovel. Like a normal old shovel. Yes, because those are the only ones that I can make normal ones of right now. They might be the only ones I can make normal ones of, period, honestly. Because the fishing rod... Is the fishing rod flimsy? Oh, no, I can make a non-flimsy fishing rod now. I just need another iron nugget. Hmm, okay. I can make another watering can, but I already have two of those. Don't need another vaulting pole. Okay, I'm going to go back outside. Oh, after I collect these nook miles. Uh, oh, nook miles for crafting things. Yes, claim those. Okay, so I'm gonna go and keep, yeah, smacking rocks and stuff like that. Okay, so now I'm gonna take my good axe and 
chop this tree with it. Oh! Okay, this axe can actually chop down trees. So, might not want to use this one. Wait, so now if I grab my actual shovel... No, I did not want to do that. I wanted to do that. Oh! So I can remove annoying- Yes! Okay, I can finally get rid of this stupid tree that's been annoying me forever. Okay. So that thing I said about cutting down the trees... Okay, good. Now... If I just leave the stump here, will it do anything? Oh, here's a test. Can I dig this up with a flimsy shovel? Oh, I can, looks like. I'm gonna use the flimsy shovel for now, just so that I break it. Although now, see, now I feel like I have to have a... Like a non... A non-fancy axe, so that I don't end up... Um... Breaking every tree that I... So I need five tree branches and... A stone, right? To make another one? There we go. Oh yes, this place feels so much more like a yard now that that's not in the way. Yeah, okay. Now that I have my house, I can start making like a little walkway up to it and stuff. That would be nice, right? Have like a front yard. Finally, these leaf eggs will make it to my... My house storage. Put in storage. And the clay that's been sitting outside forever. Put that in storage. Um... I, I, just, I just need to get 30 of something, I guess, and I can take it to... Mr. Nook, so I'm gonna do that after I craft this axe so that I can actually get... I should make more than one, although I guess I need more tree branches for that, so probably not. Okay, I'm just gonna make this. Okay, made a flimsy axe, keep crafting. I wanna see if I can... Okay, because now I can make a stone axe. I'm wondering if it's just like a more durable flimsy axe? Like it can't cut down trees? All done for now. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna equip my stone axe. No, not place, not place item. I want to, oh, I, I guess I can't equip it inside, can I? I have to go outside to equip it. Okay, so now can I equip my stone axe? Hold. Yes, I can. So can this one cut down a tree? No, okay, so th this is what I was looking for, that's good. I don't wanna cut them down, I just wanna get wood from them, which I guess, I guess in real life you do have to cut down a tree to get wood from it, but I would like to preserve the uh, the local flora as much as possible, for now at least. If I need space to build a house, I'll probably end up cutting these down. It, I, okay, I like, I like being able to cut the trees down, so like if one gets in an annoying spot I can, I can remove it, but like, I don't want to cut all the trees down because I don't want to be left on an island with no trees, you know what I'm saying? So. Okay, so let's see, um, how much... Okay, I have 8 hardwood right now, let's see if I can get up to 30. Anyways, after that slight interruption, back to collecting wood. Got a call from my teacher, so I kinda had to take it. Um, <laughs> it was just about a school project, not that big a deal. Uh, anyway, so, back to Animal Crossing, which is much more fun than school, I will say. Okay, so my teacher called again, and uh, while I was talking to him, I was running around collecting wood because I knew I was going to cut that out of the video during editing anyway. Um, <laughs> so I've gotten in my storage right now, I have uh, 30 softwood and 20 hardwood, and I have another, oh I have 14 wood, okay so I have, I need 10 more hardwood and 14 more normal wood, then I'll be able to take all that wood to him. Oh yeah, I also have to make another axe. Ooh, a glowy thing. So I've heard that you can actually cook, dig up these glowy things with a shovel. So I'm gonna... No. <laughs> My character in this game sometimes. Okay. No. <laughs> no, okay. No, okay, I want you to dig up that glowy thing. There we go. Look, I dug up a thousand bells. Okay, but I'm not gonna... Wait, what? Oh, okay. But, you know what I all, what I heard is, you can plant this. So I'm going to go over here to where my house is and turn this 1,000 bells into 3,000 bells. And uh, see if I uh, bury in a hole. And then watering can. Let's water it. 
Oh, jeez. <laughs> Water it. No. <laughs> Animal Crossing. Come on. Water it. Oh my gosh. Okay, water it. There we go. And might as well water these while I'm, while I'm out here with the watering can. Okay, that technically counted. Alright, so, okay, what, how are we doing on the wood stuff? Okay, so I need a couple more of those. I need ten more hardwood. I need more hardwood still. Okay, so I'm going to equip my stone axe. Hold. And we come over here. I believe I already got this tree. Off work. Not again. Not again. No, 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 no. No, 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 I guess that happened while I wasn't recording. Oh my gosh, okay. <sighs> I used my medicine already, jeez. Boom. Oh, I can't use it here? Oh yeah, I can. Okay. Now I'm gonna go and tell the guy that I have enough wood to build a shop, although I do have to go to my house and get the rest of it first. So, vaulting pole time. All right, here, mate, I got your wood. What do you want now? living here. Okay. Oh, hey! I heard you're helping us out by gathering materials to build the shop. I'm sorry to place such a burden on you, but we really do appreciate helping you improve the island. Okay, I think it's you that wants it then. Welcome, Corvette C7. How can I help you today? Uh, about building a shop. Right now, we're asking residents for the help donating materials we need to build the shop. Uh, I'd like to donate. Oh, you'll make a donation? Thank you so much for helping us. Right now you have some softwood, wood, and hardwood. You'll have to donate 30 of each. Uh, these are for you. <sighs> Thank you so much. We only need one last bit to research our donation goal. Reach our donation goals for the stuff. <laughs> uh, Thank you. Let me offer you some flagstone flooring, a yellow quilt wall, and a homework, a homework set. Dude, this game is supposed to be fun. <laughs> and uh, loan payment, uh, pay to two A from pockets, full amount, uh, full amount, and then yeah, okay. made our loan a little bit less. Uh, redeem Nook Miles. I want to see if I can buy anything with anything of interest with thirteen hundred. I want to buy this, so I'm just gonna do it right now. Redeem eight hundred miles for custom design pro editor. Yes. Because if I buy it now, it won't be distracting me later. Reach your nook phone, your terminal to receive the app data. Okay. Your app has been updated. Thank you for using the Nook Stop. I've got the Pro Edition of the Custom Designs app. Now I'm going to make my debut as a pro designer. <laughs> no, I'm just going to keep it on my phone forever. Um, oh, cool. Okay, what is the homework? Okay, I can't use the item. Okay, I want to know what homework set looks like. I'm going to go back to my house. Okay, place item. Oh my gosh, so it literally looks like school homework. <laughs> That's funny. I think that is going to be it for this episode of Animal Crossing New Horizons, everybody. If you liked it, please leave a like on it, and I will see you all next time. Goodbye.